Away from security matters, let's talk budget. Uh, the call by Chief Justice Father to, to have judiciary be allocated 4 billion shillings has failed after President Uhuru signed the supplementary appropriation bill which allocated them 1.5 billion shillings. The bill, which was signed by the President today, is entrenched with austerity measures that will guard government expenditure for the financial year ending June 30th, 2019, as the government seeks to cut its expending. The lion's share of the 47 billion shillings has been allocated to his affordable housing agenda, which got 21 billion shillings. President Uru Kenyatta put ink to paper as he signed into law the supplementary appropriation bill number no. 2 of 2018, embedding austerity measures that will guide government expenditure as it seeks to cut its spending. The law mandates the National Treasury to issue shillings 47 billion from the consolidated fund for the provision of various public services. Despite pleas by Chief Justice Dewi Maraga to have judiciary be allocated 4 billion, it has been allocated 1.5 billion. Maraga had requested more cash to increase the number of courts as well as hire more judges. According to Justice Maraga, the judiciary had sought a budget of shillings 31.2 billion, but the Treasury budget policy statement capped it at shillings 17.3 billion. The amount was, however, reduced by Parliament through the Appropriation Act to shillings 14.5 billion. This is even despite the promise by President Uru Kenyatta to review the judiciary budget. Uhuru proposed additional funding for the judiciary and the multi-agency team, which include the DCI, DPP and ESCC, to improve the fight against graft. The housing agenda, which is under the Big Four agenda, is set to receive the largest share of $21 billion out of the $47 billion set aside. The State of Department of Housing is set to undertake a project of providing 500,000 decent affordable housing units by 2022. The bill signed by President Uru Kenyatta also allocates shillings 2 billion to the State Department of Tourism for promotion programs, while the State Department of Wildlife has been assigned 873 million. The State Department of Public Works has been given shillings 1.9 billion. The bill was presented to the President Kenyatta for signing by the National Assembly Speaker Justin Muturi. Al Mwangi, KTV.